Let's get it. Shout out Phidias. I have absolutely nothing with me, not even clothes. And my goal is to travel around the world for free. But first, I need to find a t-shirt. Buy a house. You want me to give you a t-shirt? Yes. Yes, yes. I will wear this in all my journey. Oh my God. After this, while I was walking on the famous Hollywood street, someone gave me his jacket. Socks as well. Oh, shit. Oh my God. <laughs> Look who it is! Do you want some shoes? No, I want your shoes. Oh, you want my shoes? Can I get your shoes? Yes, have them, have and, them, have and, them. And can I get this as well? My pants? Oh, yeah. you got my pants? You are going to wear them. I want to buy you pants. Okay. Come here, we'll buy some pants. Well, there you go. This is the pants that he bought. He's gonna see ya. I love you, bye bye. So now we're going to Santa Monica Pier to collect money. Okay, here we are. I'm collecting money to travel to Japan. Do you have any change with you guys? So what? Maybe you better twerk or something. Okay. <laughs> Oh, hell yeah. oh, oh, oh. Did I entertain you enough? <laughs> That's good. Enough for a change. Five dollars. Oh my god. Five dollars. I started asking for money Five to dollars. everyone at the pier. And even though I had some rejections, a lot of people were generous Thank and helped. We made around forty dollars in one hour. So oh if I God. stay here for six hours, I'm going to make the money for the ticket. Let's go back to work. I spent all day asking for oh money, and I'm not gonna lie, it was very hard. But I made two hundred fifty dollars in eight hours of work. This feels illegal. Now, next destination, airport. To go there. Some people don't even get half, man. Come on. Yeah, I had to sneak in the metro, which was easy. But while I was recording myself in the metro, this happened. What that bitch talking shit to me? That's right, white boy. You better turn that shit off, nigga. A stranger got mad at me that I was filming, and he started threatening me. And while we were talking, he took an axe from his back and broke the window next to me. Honestly, guys, now I'm afraid for my life. So I left the train now. This, I think, was the most dangerous moment of my life. That's crazy. I want to buy a ticket. Okay. I can see passport. Yes. Thank you. I think I've seen you on YouTube, aren't you? Don't you like, didn't you hug um, Elon Musk? I saw yes. that, man. Yeah, that was him. Yes, Elon Musk is amazing. He's my hero. Take a seat. Where now we look at the price first and we let you know. Okay, thank you. If they say something more than 250, I'm fucked. Hello, sir. The price will be 1290 Oh my god. Oh my god, that's a lot of money. Right now, the fly is full. That's why the price is... That's well, I only have 250. You gotta work. Yes, we are. You literally have to work like what? Four more days, five more days to be able to afford that. God damn. Not go in Japan. I asked the information desk and they told me that between Los Angeles and Japan is Hawaii. So it's better for me to fly tonight to Hawaii and get money from there to go to Japan. I didn't have any other choice. With the money I had, I bought a ticket to Hawaii. Aloha. Aloha. <laughs> We're going to Hawaii. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like a kid in the park. <laughs> Hawaii welcome. The girl I next to me saw me holding a camera and she started asking questions. And when I told her the truth that I don't have a place to stay, she said this. I have a couple of friends that might be able to host you. Yeah, it's a place to stay. <laughs> Hawaii, here we are. My man went to Hawaii for free. You are in Hawaii now. I know that. <laughs> she not only found a place for me to stay, she took me to that place with her car. Oh. That's crazy! Oh my god, what is this? It's a lake! Yes, we're in Hawaii! Perfect! Her place was beautiful. I can't believe I got all this for oh, free. free! Guess what, guys? We're going to the beach! Yes. Oh my god! I can't believe this is true. Oh my god! Sheesh. This guy makes people dream, yo! After I spent some time in the Small, car like... talking with police, I think... Because the thing is like... Not small. I don't. I don't mean small. It's like, it's doable. It's doable. But to take the measures to do that, it's hard, bro. It's it's, it's definitely very hard. Cause I don't think you'll be. You probably be like that comfortable with literally just like going outside asking strangers for for something, and like sometimes your influence. I guess it kind of helps, especially for example, Rucker Rucker uh, managed to buy him some um some trousers and then random strange uh, like. You know, I guess you kind of need to have like a story as well. He said he wanted to like go to Japan, so people were definitely helping him out. We'll get him some money. 
uh, which, yeah, you can, I guess. She's the most open minded girl I, I ever what? met in my life. Here we are, we came in the beach. Oh I love traveling God. so much. Woohoo! The best! Woo! Woo! Today, I will enjoy a bit traveling, and tomorrow, we worry about how I'm going. My man is traveling for free to get to Japan. That's oh crazy. my God, look at these guys. I love it here. Thank you so much. And the sun is going down. This is the second night of the challenge. She cooked Japanese food. Is this a coincidence? I'm going to Japan next. But the struggle was yet to come. I just woke up and look at this. Wow. So yesterday it was relaxing and traveling. And today it's time to see how we're going to get out of here to go to Japan. No jokes now. I was talking with my beautiful friends here. <laughs> <laughs> Pauline had a great idea about a surfboard. They have surfboards here. This yeah. one? I'm going to rent it to people for $20 an hour oh my this is god the greatest idea right? a person ever had this is my money making vehicle looks good i will try to bring everything back <laughs> please do <laughs> i have a surfboard and i'm going to the beach to make some money i can't believe it's winter look at this guy feels like a summer the goal today is to make 210 dollars for the ticket i have a surfboard my goal is to collect money to go to japan okay do you want to rent my surfboard do i want to <laughs> <laughs> i don't think that would be a good idea for me or your surfboard well, i think we're okay no so you are not going to be my first customer today. i'm so sorry not today, not today. I'm sorry. i will leave my shoes here and i'll go around and ask for people do you want to rent my surfboard by any chance for one hour uh, me either, but you can try to learn. It's all good. Thank, <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Failure. I think wow. my approach is wrong. I'm asking this surfboard. Are you interested, beautiful girl? This is the best deal of your life, I promise. Sir, I know you want to rent this. How much? $20 an hour. I've never tried It's okay. You can try now. And you go with me? If you want me to go with you, it's $40. But you can... <laughs> Yes, if you want uh, four I mean, such as mess. well, fifty dollars. Okay. And so I just ruined my fucking carpet. Oh my god. Fifty dollars. Yes. Um, that's my deposit money gone. Good for I promise. So we're going together. I will show you how to surf, but I never surfed in my life. Are you oh ready? You have to do up when wave is coming. Show me. <laughs> <laughs> Am I a good oh teacher or no? <laughs> when a wave comes, you have to be very fast with your hands, okay? This is great, guys. Fast, 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 fast. This is the meaning of an entrepreneur, bro. This, this, brother, this teaches you a lot. I'm telling you, this teaches you a lot. Oh my God, this wings is so hot. This teaches you a lot, bro. Ah. When people say it's impossible, no, this guy is showing you that wherever, brother, my man is traveling around the earth for free. Of course it's possible, whatever you want to do. You had fun? Just don't try to fly. Yes. After we came out, other people got jealous and they came to rent my surf. Oh so my this God. Guy accepted with $30. So far we have a hundred, another 110 to go. Love your content, man. It's inspiring. Oh, wow. Oh. You see, this is what I'm saying. Having some type of an influence as well, it helps, it helps want a lot. to be my next customer? Um, I don't really serve, but how about, are, are you hungry? I guess, yeah. Yeah? <laughs> you know. Free food? Oh, oh my wow. god! Thank you for the meal so much, guys. Have an amazing vacation. I love this life, these experiences, ups and downs. When you have nothing and you get something, it's, it's amazing. amazing. So true. I forgot my shoes in the other side of the beach. So I'm walking back now to find them. Let's Ooh. see if my shoes are there. Okay. Oh no, oh, this is very still there. Surprising. People in Hawaii doesn't steal. Oh my God, home sweet home. I'm so tired. Making for my first time in my life. <laughs> Cookies. This is actually the first time in my life that I'm baking something. Mom, I made it. <laughs> Not bad. Oh my god. They are Not actually bad. good. <laughs> Not bad, bro. Not bad for a first time. Sleep. 
tomorrow we need to collect another 107 dollars exactly i came to the beach but i'm very tired because it was one hour walk with the surfboard wow but, but we have to do what we have to do oh, i Jesus. did the same thing all day teaching people how to surf and renting my surfboard and finally yes i found my last customer yes Thank Yo, you so much. I'm so gasped. dollars I'm going to Japan. Let me see how it's going to go to Japan. And this is the last night, and she made me food. I know. I'm gonna miss you. The next morning, Polly took me to the airport, and she gave me a gift card and told me to read it in the plane. I love you. Oh Thank wow! You so much for everything. She even wrote a message. Oh my God. Nah. Best host. No in way. Life. And the show must go on. My first time to Japan. Oh, very good. Yeah, enjoy. enjoy. <laughs> Thank you. Ready to go. It's a seven hour flight and we're getting closer to Japan. This is what she wrote. I'm amazed by your integrity and drive to accomplish the goals you set for yourself. My only wish is to use your platform to showcase the good in the world and spread kindness everywhere you go yes, i sir. promise you pauline i will try my best and a card of surfing this is day five of this journey very tiring so far but very educational and rewarding as well japan the only goal is to not get arrested now i'm in a place close to tokyo and i need to find a way to go to tokyo by stealing the train they told me that this train goes to tokyo I'm going to go in the train now oh the person that checks the ticket is coming <laughs> that's why i'm so going to up. lock myself the whole time in the toilet so they don't check the ticket that i don't have good old trick does it work in japan knocking the door Checking the GPS and it says that we are here. Oh my god. We are here. So he basically just waited the whole time in the toilet. Oh my god. That is so smart. <laughs> and this that is, is so how smart. You take the train for free. Here I am in Tokyo. This is the most polite people I met in my whole life, man. There is so many people, but it's kind of peaceful. Say cheese! <laughs> I am trying to make money here in Japan. What do you suggest for me to make money? Have a drink, e-commerce. E-commerce? Yeah. <laughs> you don't think I will be able to make money here in Japan? No. Ah, wow. Not a lot of people speak English here. And I'll have a hard time making money, guys. So there is a big trick when you travel for free. And actually, when you travel generally. Couch surfing. This is not an ad. Stay here and listen. Couch surfing is an application that locals host you for free in their house. I found a person through the application and oh. I'm going to meet him now. Yeah, I know, I know, I know someone. I know someone who, who wants to do that. And and the um the way that was explained, it kind of makes sense whatever he's saying now. So like maybe you can uh I think the way the way that this person told me was like he goes to like let's say uh any of these countries right that let's say have a very um like they have a lot of difficulties speaking english right yeah so just teach them just teach them english for a few hours like you i don't think the way that you charge is for like you teach them english and they give you accommodation or they give you food or water whatever it is right and then yeah you just continue about your journey like the thing is like if you have a lot of money, I guess it kind of makes the journey a little bit less exciting because you have everything already. So, you know, if you if you do, for example, like Fides is doing, he doesn't have anything. So you just need to go around and find and find out and find out like, yo, it's crazy. In this place here. Oh my God, it's cold. Thank God that I have a place to stay tonight. Oh my God, nice to meet you. Good to meet you. This is <laughs> my couch surfing host. And you hosted how many people? Probably about 300. Oh my God, this is crazy. And this is, it's warm. Oh wow. <laughs> Why do you host? 
Peter. Why do I host people? To meet interesting people. Otherwise, I'm just working all the time. Everyone has a different story, right? I get to learn something about the country. I get to That's learn crazy, them. bro. Everyone has a story why they're doing it, why they can't. This guy is not the normal couch surfing guy. Normal couch surfer, they host maybe 20 people, maybe max. But, he, but this guy hosted 300 He people. goes to the street. After I told him I didn't eat food for 24 hours, he immediately took me out for dinner. Thank you so much. That's crazy. <laughs> So He's paying for my food, guys. Oh, so tomorrow we need to find out how we are going to make money. Yeah. And as I understood, it's going to be probably the most difficult task of this video. And this is the couch that I'm going to sleep on. Good night. The next day, my host had an idea for me to make money. There, there you the go. I was literally we're... talking about English lesson. Like, I was literally just talking about it. Like, that's what I'm saying. You can go. Hold on. That's what I'm saying. You can literally just go. Teaching Japanese people how to speak English. It's about seventy-five dollars an hour. Now we just. Wow. Sounds 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 a bit pushy, but. Just need to show this. To I guess he probably should have started at least, uh, you know, slower. Even I mean I, I don't know how how for example the money works in there like, maybe he charged seventy four pounds seventy five pounds an hour. Because he wants to, sorry, get like an accommodation or obviously buy some extra clothes, food. Uh, let's say what else? I'm not sure. Maybe battery for the GoPro. Whatever it is, like you gotta do something. So I guess maybe that's why. Two thousands of people. So I'm here in one of the biggest train stations in Tokyo. I will just hold my sign like this. Let's see how much time it will take me to get my first client. So it's been an hour that I'm standing here and nobody came to even talk to me. So I think this is the wrong approach. Hello. English lesson? English lesson? No. I don't know how I'm going to live from Japan, honestly. It's crazy. He said it's too expensive. Yeah. People here are a bit more close and shy. They are not open. 10,000, bro. 10,000 sounds a lot. That's what I'm saying. I think it should, it should like maybe go with a definitely like a lower number a way lower number just to start and then i guess as you start collecting money then let's say you can increase your price pen to talk with strangers i'm doing this for five hours now and it's not working but at least i have a good view of tokyo it's very difficult to make money here guys the people are not very approachable not very social this is the lowest point that i've been in this video clearly the sign is not working so we're going to try a different approach we're going to ask people to pay for our entire ticket do you want to be that person not a chance i wish i could but i don't have enough money man no we're a Americans, we don't give anything out for free. Nothing Damn. seems to be working, guys. I'm a disaster. Talking I'm about please of a line. I'm a complete failure. Definitely today was the toughest day of the challenge. The people are, are polite and they are nice, but it's very difficult to speak with them and connect with them. Japan, a difficult destination. Ah! So because I did it easily. Why? Why would you do that, bro? Why? <laughs> Why, why would he do that? Oh my god, nah. Ah! Everyone looking back. <laughs> and like, so is this because guy I crazy? did it easily on United States, India, and Europe, I thought that I, I would do it easily, but... I haven't made a single dollar all day. All I can do now is go home, sleep, and hope that the next day would be better. We just woke up, this is day seven. He was seeing me that I was struggling a lot with making money in Japan and he said that he will help Oh no, he's not using a GoPro because normally he will be using a GoPro but he's using a, I don't know, maybe he's a Canon or something. The ticket, guys. Yeah. Oh my God, there thank you, go. you so much. No worries. I got a bit emotional because I was not expecting this. There is something special happening. Oh my God, it's guys, snow. it's snowing. <laughs> it's oh cold, God. it's freezing. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. Look at all these kids waiting. Hello. Hello. Let's eat some. Free water. After a lot of... Smart.
Smart, as long as you get, grab it from a place that's very clean. Of relaxing hours, it was time for me to leave. It sucks that I'm leaving, but the show must go on. It's raining. I can't go like this. I'm going to the shop here and I will beg them to give me an umbrella. The first person I asked in the shop gave me his umbrella. Thank you, thank you. Uh, no, no, <laughs> thank you. Have an amazing day. People they are, are amazing. That's the thing. They are amazing people, bro. Yeah. It's true. It's true, bro. It's true. Because think about it, right? You're literally going to somewhere you've probably never been before, right? You have no money, no probably... I mean, you have clothes. he has clothes with him and probably some supplies in the back, but you have no money. You can't rent a hotel. Um, that you, Let's say you probably cannot eat. Like, that's the thing. You have to be patient. Sometimes it takes the whole day to make at least probably like $1 or something like that. So, yeah, it's... it's brother, it's... It's, it's very challenging, man. It's very challenging. But let's say for the experience, right? For the experience, it's probably worth it, man. It's definitely worth it for the experience. Are nice here as well. <laughs> it's raining, man. And the thing is, like, no one really. Apart, apart from this lady right here, I don't know. <laughs> apart from this lady right here, I think she's probably not from there. She's definitely not from there. Because the rest is all paying attention to their phones, but she's uh, she's literally not even caring. Never saw anything like that in their whole life. They are NPCs. Look at that. <laughs> That's true. That's true, bro. I'm going to try to sneak in the business class of the plane. I'm going to wait for everyone to go in, and then if it's an empty seat inside the business class, I will go in. Thank you very much, Angel. My Bye. pleasure. Have a good Bye. day. So, sneaking in operation starts now. I immediately went and sat in the only empty seat in the business class. I'm not gonna lie, this no is the way. craziest thing ever. No way. No way. Hey, brother, ain't no <laughs> way. <laughs> From no money, please. They started offering free drinks and snacks. After enjoying one hour of business class, finally they understood that I was not supposed to be there and they moved me back to the economy class. So I got caught. It almost worked. Dubai, I mean, I'm well, coming. Oh, now he's going to Dubai. Oh, wow. I guess in Dubai, maybe people might be, might be, like, there might be better opportunities rather than Tokyo. But let's see. So we just landed in Abu Dhabi. I will try to sleep in the airport and I will wake up tomorrow. People don't steal bugs in an airport. I have experience here. I stay seven days in an airport. Not even if you go to Dubai, if you go to like any Arab in United Arab, Arab United Arab Emirate country, you can leave your stuff anywhere. You'll definitely when you come back, you will find it there. They don't steal in in uh, in the UAE. They don't port, live it anywhere. Stuff all the time, and they were not getting stolen. Go watch that video after. But you know that it's dangerous to leave uh, unintended bags at the airport. That's maybe one of the reasons why I would advise you to never leave it at the airport. It's not very comfortable, but I don't have another choice. So I just woke up. Today is day ten. I'm going to try now to go to Dubai to see the world's tallest building. Ooh, it's been ten days that I'm wearing this. Burj Khalifa, yes. So I'm going to the toilet and I will be back. Oh, two, one. <laughs> I bet you didn't expect this. The sponsor of this video is Kofandi. Actually, Kofandi makes go. good quality, affordable clothes for men. I'm so excited to show all this stuff. Sir, what do you think about my clothes? They're very good. You look good. <laughs> Very good. I look sexy. You do, you do. <laughs> Go now to their website and check their whole clothing line. They have a lot of clothes for gym, for everyday life. I still have this on so I can sell it and make money. <laughs> so this is how I'm going there you go. I'm telling you, my man is a whole entrepreneur, bro. To make money I swear. To buy. Go now to the top link on the description and use my code to get a discount. Cheat codes, bro. Cheat codes. Literally, cheat codes. Cofundy.com. Oh my god. Have a great day, thank you. You see, I'm telling you, people in the UAE are different level. Man. Have an easy time here in this country. So this time I'm not going to sneak in the bus luggage. I have a ticket. Thank you. 
We're here and I have to make money. But I'm tired of making money. So I can't wait to go back home in my apartment actually. I'm sitting here in the mall in Dubai and I met this guy. What's your name? Sunny. And he's from India and we're chatting about his business now. I have a question for you, okay? Hold this. What do you think about it? Cloth is very nice. Very nice. Oh. Do you want to buy it to help me go to Europe? <laughs> but I don't need Burj Khalifa. It's huge. He literally said he doesn't need, but I mean, if you want, maybe if you want to help, you can probably give it away. That's what she said. <laughs> I started asking strangers if they want to buy the clothes, and immediately I found a person that was interested. So do you want it? Good. And that's really cheap. It will help me a lot. Okay, let's see. Let's go! 90. Oh, it's 90. Oh. Let's okay, go, bro! You are the best. Every money is money! For him, at this point, brother, every money is money. Try to hug Donald Trump or Joe Biden. Ah, they know him. Makes sense. They know him. So I guess... That's what I'm saying. The influence here... The influence here helps a lot. <laughs> we made all the money and now my plane leaves in 24 hours. So we can enjoy a bit of Dubai. But there is some problems. We don't have a place to stay. And also, we don't have friends. I'm going to show you how I make friends. What you don't like about Dubai? I'm here for uh, three days now and I don't have anything to say about what I don't like. I love Dubai. Tell me one thing you love about Dubai. Freedom. Freedom. Yeah. My favorite thing about Dubai is that it's very diverse. There is people from Pakistan, from India, from all over the world. In some countries they do exclusions, but Dubai I don't think it does. You ask where I'm staying in Dubai, right? So I have no place to stay tonight. I'm going to stay in the beach. Are you serious? This is my job. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah. Oh, amazing. Hopefully it doesn't get very cold in the night. Do you have a place for me to stay or a couch or anything? What's up, Sadino? <laughs> place where I am. What's poppin', my bro? In a small room. You have the bunker bits and I am living there. Okay, so it will difficult. be difficult. Very okay, difficult, yeah. good, good. I feel sorry. To no, say this. no, no, you don't feel. This is it's bad to feel sorry. Tonight we're going to stay outside. It will be fun mm. one night in the tree. So where is he gonna go and sleep? Probably the Dubai mall is probably gonna be closed. I'm not sure how they operate. So I walked straight to the closest beach. Because in this Found. video they stole my okay. stuff. I brought a locket now and I locked my stuff on the bed. So now I can sleep without fearing that someone will steal my bag. It's time to sleep with this beautiful wow. view. Wow. I'm very lucky to believe in these experiences, I'm not gonna lie. I have a pillow, five star. And hopefully it's not an offense or something like that, right? For him to just sleep uh, like on the beach just like that. Bet. Good night guys, see you tomorrow. I just woke up in the beach and I see something incredible. Wow. This experience wow. of living yes, is amazing. <laughs> We're so fortunate to be alive. So I left from... Yeah, outside. He literally just done that, bro. He doesn't beach. care. So I'm walking back to the airport to go to a place that I always was dreaming about. Italy. So we're going to make my dream a reality together. So, so I he just wants arrived to go in Italy. the airport. I want to find out where is he where is he from because I always thought he was Italian to be honest. And we're going to Italy! They are not as excited as I am. Definitely not. Especially not after you scream We're like that. We're out of the airport now. It 